lovely fellows welcome back to my garden hope you all are fine have a blessed day so today i want to show you my spring flowers on my rooftop garden and we will discuss about petonias today one of my most favorite spring flowers it's really beautiful having lots of shades lot of colors i think most of you must have this in your garden so especially beginners who don't have it i want to share some information with you guys so they are uh, available in variety of colors and uh, it starts blooming in february although we saw their seeds in october november and uh, they will give you very rich flowers only if you are following some basic steps it's really easy to care easy to fertilize easy to water there are no hard and fast rules for this plant you will have a massive amount of flowers if you are caring it properly it keeps on blooming i think till may to june it depends on how you are caring them how much you are caring them so so you can see they are spent flowers also on on my these pots so what you have to do is when they grow or when they are starting their blooms or their spent flowers you just have to remove them or you have to pinch them now how you will pinch them or remove them i will show you whenever you see in your garden like this spent flower you have to cut it from let me show you from here so this is the very important step why it's important because you will have more blooms if you are doing this you can see my parrot also in my garden sitting and enjoying okay now i will talk about its sunlight requirement this plant needs at least 4 to 6 hours sunlight daily full sun so this is a full sun plant you cannot place it in shade this requires full light and please this is the basic requirement of this plant and then you have to water it according to its soil if it's dry you have to water it and do, don't water it on its leaves because this plant doesn't like humidity so you have to water it directly in its soil and uh, then let's talk about its fertilizer i personally as you are seeing the blooms i just added cow dung you can add any other organic fertilizer also it's up to you that will also work but i have added cow dung and uh, when the flowers are blooming especially in spring you have to add it after 15 days 20 days so they will give you more blooms more rich it will look then you can also make baskets of it and uh, but if you are making baskets keep in mind you have to put co coco peat in it at least 50 percent because it, its soil should be then lightweight and you can place it anywhere i mean in sunlight but you can make borders you can make corners and providing its basic needs as you see it's looking so beautiful it's enhancing the beauty of garden and the people who don't have this in the spring must have it in the next year and you will definitely going to enjoy it so if you feel your uh, plant is having this plant petonia is having any type of infection then you can add a neem powder easily available in nurseries uh, you can take at least one teaspoon 
in uh, one liter uh, water and give it to all plants or you can spray it as well so I think I have given you a lot of information about this so enjoy these flowers Thank you.